between Tony Ferguson and Conor McGregor. Ferguson versus Conor McGregor. We are underway. Your thoughts on Ferguson and how he's going to approach this match? El Kukui, El Kukui. <laughs> El Kukui needs to get in Conor's face, make this a dirty fight, and just start to beat on him. He's the bigger fighter. He's the longer fighter. He has to back Conor up and just start to brutalize him with all those skills that he possesses. All right, so he's sort of turtled up here. Not great body language. Perhaps he's trying to bait him in a little bit. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. It's big, powerful punch land. Now he gets back to range. It's such a fast leg kick. Beautiful land there by McGregor. Made it look easy on that exchange. He is such a diverse striker, but he's very tricky in the approach when he's trying to land that left hand. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Lands a nice straight punch there. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. What do you follow up with a great punch like this with? I'm excited to see what happens. All right, under three minutes now to go in round one. Oh, McGregor's head kick is blocked, so no damage inflicted there. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Ferguson gets caught by that straight punch. That'll get his attention. Another punch to the head. Nice one two there. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great ones. So just over 20 total strikes have landed for Conor McGregor. Ferguson gets hit with that hook. He's got to be careful here. Big punch land goes to the top. How's he going to follow this one? There's no tell on that leg kick. And he caught the kick. I mean, this guy is really focused on those punches to the head inside of the clinch. Look at him with his hip to that kick. Nice combination from McGregor. Over and over, he's landed a big body kick. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. Head kick lands. McGregor gets caught for that punch. Cutting them down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Effective use of the jab there by McGregor. So what a round it was for him, particularly when it comes to those body kicks, DC. Landed those body kicks every single time he threw them. Every time he decided body kick is going to be the strike, it landed. His opponent needs to do something different, or this fight is not going to last much longer. All right, second round is underway. Your thoughts on what we saw over the first five minutes? I saw a very competitive round. It was very strategic. Expect these guys to really pick it up as we go forward in this fight. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. And he connects there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by a muscle. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. Body kick now by McGregor. That is a huge shot there, DC. I'm not sure how he stayed up there. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, to stay standing shows and talks to your toughness. Oh! Shots 
landing on both sides here. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may blow. That is it! He's done! He's done! Well, it's not every day in the UFC that you see a fight ended due to a leg kick, but that one was absolutely devastating. He took away that lead leg of his opponent, who became a one-legged fighter, and then it became just a matter of time. So somewhat anticlimactic here tonight, but not for the winner, as he gets one of the bigger TKO wins of his UFC career. So a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the victory by TKO. Huge result inside the octagon tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest. At two minutes, 18 seconds of round number two. He played the winner by TKO, the notorious Connor McGregor. Well, the celebration is on over there in the corner, and nothing subdued about it. They put a lot of time into this training camp and into this performance, and certainly their athlete delivered. It was a result that they desired. They said, I don't care how this match ends, as long as I'm not standing there waiting on the judges. He got his opponent hurt, and he found the follow-up shots that allowed him to get the TKO. Man, that track, they're freaking. Oh, too much, no more speaking. Man, free man, 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 still scheming. No threats, protect my cleaners, creep them, beat it, catch my steel.